Hello everyone! Have you missed us? As we often say, we watch football from a different angle. And of course, this is not an air talk. We are serious about our goal, not to look like any other football project. Today we want to introduce our new feature, in which we're gonna be talking in more detail about the players in a fun and dynamic way. Our target – the personal life of footballers. The reason of our choice is simple. It cannot be uninteresting. Our plans include a weekly review. And friends, before we start, let's try to do the following. Two and a half thousand likes under this video will be the sign for us that we should definitely continue this feature. And let's get to know each other closer. Write in the comments your name and what team you support. And now we are starting. Hey, girls and boys! Hello from Paolo Dybala, his girlfriend Oriana Sabatini, and their charming dog of an Akita Brit. Apparently, this couple who was suffering from coronavirus finally got good. By the way, if this week you've heard about the new fourth infection of Dybala, do not believe it. Oriana has denied everything, and the photo says everything. Oh yeah, Italian teams have started the trainings. Here's a photo report from Sassuolo. Whoa, we feel a football is coming. Let's move to another star couple, Cristiano Ronaldo and Georgina Rodriguez. These guys traditionally lighten our party. We were especially impressed by Cristiano, who gave his mom an unforgettable Sunday. In Portugal, Mother's Day is celebrated on the first Sunday of May. So, Ronaldo's mom, Maria Dolores dos Santos Aveiro, is incredibly lucky to have such a son. On May the 3rd, mom posted in Instagram, Thanks to the children for the gifts I received today. And of course, Cristiano gave mother Mercedes GLC Coupe, which costs about 100,000 euros. Ronaldo, however, made a very cute and sweet post. Happy Mother's Day to two special women. Cristiano is a very suave and attentive guy. Respect for that. Friends, aren't you tired of staring at the monitors? If so, we suggest you to stretch yourself a bit and accept the challenge of Callum Hudson Odoi, who started Round the World Challenge. Yeah, this is about who will do more around the world tricks for one time. Guys, if you have no idea how to do this trick, this is not a problem. In the card up there, we leave a link to our friend Anton Pavlina from the Food Hacker channel. Check it out and learn new tricks. Well, that's it. We are calm for you. You're stretched, trained and ready to go ahead. Cristiano and Georgina pleased us with the abundance of stunning landscapes of the Portuguese Madeira. One, two, three and many, many other photos and also such a cool video shot using a drone. And there was one more picture, very delicious and watchable, but unfortunately we cannot show it here because of the rules of YouTube. Well, in general, Ronaldo had such a good time in Madeira, but we can feel some sadness of the lost photo of the mini vacation, Reflections by the Sea. This is how Cristiano signed the post, a cup of tea, the Atlantic Ocean and nothing else. And this is how Turin met Chris. A police escort, sirens and journalists filming all this. Boring! By the way, do not think that the players have a smooth life. Here's a mini digression along with Patrice Avra. My childhood was very difficult. I had many brothers and sisters. We lived on a street and sometimes I couldn't even eat normally. I'm not scared to say that I've begged for money in front of shops. I've been in front of shops and when I've seen some people I've said, can I have a euro? And sometimes they were giving me the money and sometimes not, just because I wanted to buy a sandwich. Patrice said in an interview with the official website of Manchester United. Yes, life is a complicated thing and only strong-minded people make their way. And we are returning to Georgina again. Ronaldo's bright and courageous to wear masks. But you know what? Nobody just listens to her. Here's a walk of the Suarez family. First photo, second photo. And here's a walk of the Piquet family. Of course, these photos provoked a scandal in Spain. But Georgina also doesn't feel comfortable. Another not the best example was shown by Manchester United defender Marcos Rojo, who is currently on loan in Estudiantes and having this kind of fun with friends. Frankly, this is a complete failure and very bad example. 
be like Jose. Tottenham's coach is once again helping to deliver food to those in need during the coronavirus pandemic. Big respect! Mourinho, you are indeed the special one. Erling Holland is also a special one. He seems to have revealed his favorite in the battle of Ronaldo and Messi. Messi or Ronaldo? I can't answer here, he said in an interview with ESPN. Then, the Norwegian was asked, who will win the Ballon d'Or in 2025? And Erling answered, Messi. It seems that a powerful replenishment has arrived in Leo's fanbase. Friends, how did you like the first episode of the rubric? Remember, two and a half thousand likes and we continue this format for you. Inside football, we watch football from a different angle. Subscribe and tell your friends about us. We want to do even more content. The more subscriptions, the more videos from our team. Take care, see you in a bit.